I very much kind of enjoy exploring landscape. When I mean landscape, it's not just kind of beautiful landscapes, it's the things that you don't normally notice that pass by every day. I use paint, I use things that make marks, I use 2D, 3D, I use space a lot, I use actually physically being in the landscape and making my presence felt, whether it's either by either walking a route, making a mark, or just moving some things around. I'd like to create things with whatever I find out there. I always think that, you know, an artist is someone who feels an emotion and wants to share that with other people, I think in a nutshell. And I absolutely love rambling around the place. I actually love places. I love those scenes that are painted. I love that bridge over Doncaster Road. I love the rooftop of the Hepworth. And I love that line of trees. I love that broken gate that's opposite the road from where I live. But I live, it's just those places I think are incredibly special. I get very enthusiastic about them. So I kind of want other people to get enthusiastic too, because I think it's quite a healthy thing to be enthusiastic and to feel joy and happiness about certain spaces. I'm inspired by exploration, I'm inspired by maps, and I'm inspired by cartographers and people that want to interpret the world and make sense of it. So I think that's what I'm trying to do as far as I'm concerned, is I'm trying to make sense of the world from my point of view and sharing what I think it is with others. And I like the fact that sometimes you can go into such obsessive detail, but ultimately it's futile. And so I think like my work tries to skate along that little boundary line between those two things.